What's going down, everybody? It's your boy. That guy, my high, tuning back in for another reaction. This time we got uh, a man calling 911 saying he gave somebody $25. He did not get his stuff. You know what I'm saying? He didn't get his stuff, bro. He upset. He he need his stuff. And anyway, let's give a big shout out to all the members. And let's jump into this video because it's about to be wild. We got Gary Willis, my hood life, Nugget, Liz, Amy Jane Doe, Robin Lynn, Misty Summers, Mama Dukes, Aaron, Nicole, Creatively Insane, Nick, Diesel, Marla, Hollaboy, Christy, Jordan, Funny Farm, Taylor, Hollow Jeffrey, Jamal, Lynn Willow, Epic Service, Happy Chick, Mr. Pay It Forward, Carrie, and Marie. Appreciate you guys for being members and rocking with your boy the way that you do. And uh, yeah, if you guys want to go ahead and become members as well, hit that join button down below. You got three different options to choose from. You could be a high member at $2.99. You could be a really high member at $4.99. And you could be the highest member at $9.99. And guess what? We got a free $9.99 option too. Just subscribe, hit that bell notification, and let's run this bit up. You know what I'm saying? Let's go ahead and join this video right now. Let's go. And Mm -hmm. I don't know if there's oh, hold up one second. Let's give a shout out to this channel because this is a new police channel that popped up on my feed. Columbus Police Body Cam. Shout out to them for, and we'll hit that bing, and we'll hit that bing like button. And uh, cause you never know, you know what I'm saying? They might, they, they might drop some other stuff that we want to watch. So we got to make sure we stay in tune. But you know I'm what I mean? Right it's easy as that to subscribe. I'm not getting no pussy, and I don't got no drugs for her, so I'm super fit. Flat out. Wait, what? I ain't got no drugs, and I ain't got no pussy for my twenty-five dollars, and I'm really mad. I'm, I'm, I'm hot, flat out. You know what I'm saying? I need, I need to bust a nut or go to the moon, nigga. Shit, like, what? Oh, oh, this is about to be hilarious. Oh, God. I'm so excited. You know what I'm ready for this? I don't think y'all are ready for this. I don't know if I'm ready for this. I like this little, like, family show. Sit, like, sit, family sitcom show fucking Yes, I just song. gave this guy $25 to buy me some, a crystal mask, and he ran in his house, didn't come out. And I don't want to do nothing that's irrational, but yeah, either 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 do gonna give me my money or something okay. gonna happen. So yeah, what, what's just, the what's the address? And what's your name? What the fuck, bruh? This nigga is bold enough to say, "Yo, he called the nine nine. He oh my god, my brain is so in scrambles. I almost said nine nine one. He called the nine nine one number." <laughs> He called 911 and the like the emergency line. Like this wasn't the non-emergency. This nigga called the emergency dispatch fucking line 911 and said, "Yo, this nigga took my $25 right in the house and I don't want to do nothing irrational. I either want my I, I either he gives me my money or I need I need I need my crystal, you know what I'm saying? Where my crystal at? I need I need it or I'm going to do some shit. Some shit's about to go down in this bitch like, "Oh, oh shit. Okay." My name is I'm sorry, what was it? Yeah. The air? Yeah, Pierre. Can yeah. you spell it for me? P I E R R E. That's an interesting and what's your ass phone name, number, Dier. 614. Okay, do you know this guy's name? What is something that you need to survive? De air? Ah! <laughs> okay, let's go. <laughs> Nah, so I was on Sullivan Avenue in Cyprus at this little, it's like a church building. I was just sitting under it because it was raining. It had like a little bitch on it. And a guy said that he could get me some drugs. So I said, I really don't want to do none. But when he said that it was cheap, dude took my $25 and went in his greenhouse on Dakota Avenue and didn't come out. So Okay, what did he look like? Um, he's, he's black. He has one of the uh, blue champion hoodies. And he had on black pants and a black uh, satchel or a book bag. Okay. So you just gave your money to some random ass nigga in a park or some shit because you was just sitting there under, you know, on a bench or some shit, minding your business, and some random dude walked up to you and said, you need some shit, bro. You need some shit, bro. Like, that nigga came and got you because he was fiending. He said, oh, I'm about to get this nigga. You know what I'm saying? He don't went and got, your, got that shit. Don't argue with him. Don't off. argue with him. Don't argue, man. I'm just going to call the police, like I said. Okay. And um, are you standing outside? I'm outside their house. I'm not going nowhere. I'm not scared of nothing because they got my money. Yeah. And tell me what you look like. What are you wearing? I have on a uh, cowboy boot, short, and a uh, cover. And a I'm what? sorry, a cowboy boots and what? And uh, a red t-shirt. And I'm using the cover as an uh, umbrella. 
Yeah, don't argue with him. Don't argue. Are don't you, argue with are, you, are you white, black, Hispanic, Asian? I'm, I'm black. Okay. And who's the other person in the background with you? Uh, Sarah, it's, it's just a little kid that we have that every now and then. Okay. Bruh. All right, we'll get somebody out to you, okay? <laughs> I'm yep. sorry, this nigga's right. outfit is with. This nigga said I'm standing out here in cowboy boots. I'm like, what? <laughs> nigga, this is this is Ohio. Like, niggas hey, out know, in Columbus, Ohio, going out here on? wearing cowboy boots. So, so someone robbed you? Yeah. I mean, you gave them the money. He didn't really rob you though. Uh, black dude said that he know where to get some ice from, and she said that she likes to smoke it. So, because I'm trying to show her a good time, it's like, I, I was going on a fight to get dude money, and then the fuck said, so you, got, you guys were going to buy drugs? Yeah. 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 Don't lie to this man. Don't, don't lie, because it'll be fucked up. Yes. Okay. I, I was going to get her high, so I... Okay. Flat out. There's no need to sugarcoat what's going on. I tell her, let me talk for a reason. All right. And dude, Brandon's house never came out, so... Uh, what the fuck, bro? I'm like flabbergasted. He said, don't lie to this man. Yeah, I was trying to buy drugs, get this bitch high so I could fuck. Oh. Oh. Um. Um. I don't think, I don't think you were supposed to tell police that, bro. I mean, I know you was trying to be real honest and shit. I know you out here trying to be real honest and shit. But I don't think you was supposed to tell the police that, bro. I'm pretty sure they're going to they arrest your ass for out here trying to buy drugs. You know what I'm saying? It's one thing to sit there and be like, I was out here, you know, just hanging out with that bitch and we was trying to have a good time. But you flat out was just, yeah, I'm trying to get some drugs so I can get this bitch high so I can fuck. Like, what? They, they they do it different in Ohio, goddamn. <laughs> on the end of Cypress right here, just sitting in a, in a little a vintage right there. That's in front of that little church building. And mm -hmm. I don't know if there's cameras or what, but I'm just telling you, dude ran off of my money, and I'm not getting no pussy, and I don't got no drugs for her. So I'm sorry. <laughs> and she walked off. All right. And that's what's really going on. Well. Oh, no, she's not going to be able to get your money back. Okay, like, that part's cool. But, dude. Okay. So it, Keep your hand in your pocket. Oh, I'm, I'm uh, sorry, sir. Nah, that's all right. W wallet chain. I'm that's sorry. Okay. I'll, I'll just show you. I don't. I, I don't have you. no weapons. I don't. I don't. Sir. No. Okay. I got, I, I got a little something here. I, I got don't you. Have weapons. I don't, man. All right. So, so that's why I homeboy, my... homeboy, grab your money, yeah. ran in the house, and, and then came house. back. He took it and ran and then come out. So. Okay. Therefore, at the end of the day, instead of doing some bullshit, I said I'm gonna stand here until the police come. I'm not scared of you. Like I'm not scared. Like you stole my shit, and I don't care. Do what you gotta do, but I'm gonna call the police instead of do something crazy. And we're gonna get to the bottom of why you ran off on my shit. There are guns down there. They're sitting around. All right. Um, okay, where were they at? What? <laughs> oh my God. Dude, bro, I'm sorry. I, look, the cop don't even know what to say, dog. I feel you, bro. This is one of them calls like, why did you call us? Why? Why, bro? Why did you call? Oh, because you called over $25 as a pussy nigga? Damn, you are on the you have hit rock bottom if you calling the police over twenty five dollars and some pussy. What the fuck? Oh my god! Do you know these people here then? Nah, I don't know these people. I thought you said they ran into this house. Yeah. Yes. Okay. I followed dude down the alley. Dude went in this house. Dude went in this house with my money, so he stopped me from getting pussy because he ran off with my money to get her right. Okay, well, uh, I mean, you know, <laughs> oh my you, know we, you know we ain't going to be able to help you get your money back or your drugs or anything I'm like that. I'm not going to get money or drugs. I just, okay. I, just, I just want something to happen, man, because at the end of the day, is they, they stole my shit. Dude had a gun out, oh, and when I was going to my wallet to go through my money, he grabbed the money and ran. So at the end of the day, it's a robbery. It's like, like, oh, like he's strong right. army with a gun. You didn't, okay, you didn't mention anything about a gun. You said right, you, you just, gun now. Where, right, holy shit. That's vital information. That information would have been more important than everything else that you've been deciding to divulge, motherfucker. You, oh, you left out the, the one thing that probably would have been on, like, that helped you get some, you know, this process a little bit further along. 
You left that out? What? (laughs) Buddy, I think for real had the hopes that he was about to get his $25 back or the drugs. And he was about to go get some pussy. Like, that was that's the goal still. He still just wants some pussy. That's it. So the gun was on his hip. The guy didn't just say, give me your money. The guy had his gun shown. He was like, oh, he ground money and took off. And yeah. this happened right at, Cent- or at uh, Sullivan in Cyprus? Yep. yep. And then he went run down this alley, ran in his house? Yep. Okay. But did he, did he threaten you at all with the gun, or did he just... He, he just he just had it out. He had the gun out on his head. He snatched my money. I seen was it on a holster or in his waistband? It was, it was just in his waistband. It wasn't just in his waistband. Yeah, it, it wasn't. All right. So he, he he told you that he knew where to get ice. Yeah. And you were like, that sounds cool. I'm about to do that. Flat out. And you yeah. pulled out money and he grabbed had it his ran. had his gun in his waistband. Like this, like. And then he grabbed it and ran, ran on here. Ran, ran in his here. house. So. Bro, this shit does not sound like no fucking robbery to me. This sound like you was. You was feeding for some pussy. You was feeding for some pussy, and you mad because that was the last $25. But he was like, all I got is $25. I just need some pussy today. That's it. That's all I want. I just need to get my dick wet. That's it. I just want to I just wanna dip. I just want to put the head in. You know what I'm saying? Just, just the tip. I just need to go get it wet. Like, <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, I right. told him I'm not leaving to This is the he craziest any, he shit ever. He didn't make any threats, though. He didn't pull it out. He didn't fire any gunshots off or point at you or anything like that. All right, and you said there's a camera. Is the camera going to be able to show him how a gun? I don't know if there's a camera. I'm saying it's a Sullivan, and everybody knows what goes to the Sullivan. Ma'am! She's mad because she ain't got her drugs. I'm just saying I was trying I mean, to help her. Yeah, that makes sense. I mean, just keeping it real. I okay. Mean, like, that's why I said just let me talk. The, the, the truth means I don't got to... Make nothing up. I can just tell it how it is. Okay. You know, she was other than that before I was trying to get it right. So why don't we just keep it real? All right, yep. Well... Yeah, I mean, he, yeah, he, he may have had a gun. <laughs> you know, it's so funny. This nigga reminds me of one of my uncles, bro. This nigga reminds me of one of my uncles. Like... <laughs> It really do. My uncle AJ, bro. This nigga, this nigga just reminds me of my uncle AJ. This nigga like 35, 36 years old or some shit. And he just he just so laid back that it's like not even funny. You know what I'm saying? Like this nigga too laid back sometimes. Like, god damn. Man. Um you say he didn't didn't point at you, didn't make any threats. No, but then that's what I'm saying is he just said, I know where you can get some yeah. ice, and you were like, okay, that sounds yes. cool. Dude. He had money out, he grabbed it and ran off. Do ran my money, so at the end of the day. Okay. It is, it is a theft. Absolutely it is. I don't, I don't want to do nothing stupid, man. I'm not going to Absolutely lie. it is. I, 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 I How much money was it? $25, man. It was 20 and a five. A 20 and a five. What does this gentleman look like? Black guy. He, I don't know. Blue check, you know, hoodie. <laughs> He had trying to figure this shit out. Like, 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 take this back, case, bro. Like, what pants. do you want me to do? And that's what I noticed. What do you really want me to do? Okay. I, I How old is he look? He looked about in his early 30s. Like, I'm in right. my early 30s. So, we had that. Height, weight on him? Yeah, he looked about a buck 50, about 5'10. Okay. And he said he ran in here. Yes, sir. All right. Uh, 20 and this a 5. This shit. Imagine being the nigga who who was over here like, oh, you need drugs, blah, blah, blah. Oh, I got you. Snatched his money and took off. Because it's probably not the first time that old buddy has done that type of shit. But this is probably the first time that he's had to been sitting inside the house looking out the window like, did this nigga really just call the cops and follow me home? What the fuck? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you, that's some shit that, who's calling about one $25 and, and that you was, you know, trying to buy drugs with, and two, who who calls because they was mad because the twenty five dollars got snatched, and that was the only twenty five dollars they had to get old girl right because he just wanted to get some pussy. Like what? This shit. Holy I'm try moly! To make contact with these guys here. You just holy hang out here moly! Do the shot. This shit is wild. Holy moly! Donut shop. Aha! Uh-huh. Holy moly! Donut shop. Say it's just brother. And There's you and your brother in her. And he's MRDD, so he ain't causing trouble for anybody. He doesn't. He said nobody came running in here recently either. All right. Um, I don't know if they did. They say they've been staying here the whole time, or did they go walking? They're down the street. 
She's a 49. We, he's trying to get her drugs for 49 activity. Uh, and it's kind of fun because he, he just flat out says it. So. <laughs> I don't think they come to my damn door and harm something about ice, ice, ice. I don't know. Maybe that's what they're down. Because there was a trap house with a ball like that. But that's my garage. There ain't. I mean, you guys can look. There's one. There's another. All right. There's nobody else in the house. Yeah, I got my brother in there. Just your brother. You mind if I just poke my head in there and say hi? (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) You could tell this is just an old dude, bro, who just like grew up in a different times. Cause, like, (laughs) the way he just referred to his brother, I ain't gonna repeat it, because in today's day and age, for real, that's. That ain't politically correct. You know what I'm saying? His his brother got some mental issues and it got some, you know, some problems and, and whatnot. You know what I mean? But he just used that big R word, but you could tell he just the old dude from a different era, bro. Is he, is that's, he, that's, he, that's, is that's, he what, that's right? what they used to, What's his name? to use and it, it wasn't necessarily like a bad word then. Hello. You know, we might have a we might have a I don't know. These people here are probably on some drugs. Or something, something but they said there's someone running the house. and That's a lie. My door's been locked all okay. morning. I've been here. You so guys right. the only ones that live here? The only one that lives here, man. Just you live here and him? Yeah. I take care of You and your brother? All right. Nobody else lives upstairs or downstairs? No, no. I mean, we got my buddy's girlfriend's here, but... Okay. Ah. That's okay. It could be. You it could be. Yeah. It could be a bit of a misunderstanding. Yeah, so. something's got to be wrong, so, coach. Yeah, he said. He says he's seen someone run into here, and no, there ain't no one in here that happen. matches the description. So I have been here all morning. So. All right. Uh, I, all right. I mean, I appreciate it. Something happened. I'll sure be one tell you guys. Yeah. All right. Appreciate it. Thanks for talking to us. Are you positive it was that house? Because I was just sitting there, walked around. There was nobody in there that matched that description. These guys, there's two old guys that live there, and they said they didn't have anyone run into their house. I, I know, I know, man. But that's was it a house? Was it a house nearby? Maybe you thought it was that one because down the alley, I mean. Now, trust me, as I was on Southern Cypress, so you can really take this alley and cut through a parking lot. Of that little building thing. It's a church right here in the parking lot. I just cut through the parking lot and watched it. Okay. I, I'm not well, watching clear as day. Okay. Well, uh, like I said, I, I was in there. Um, we did an SP. Uh, there was, there was uh, two old guys and um, I guess his his buddy's girlfriend was in there. So those were the only people in that house. Okay. So I'll take down your info. Yep. All right. Yes, I'll get sir. you a port number and whatnot. Thank you. Man. And uh, where do you stay at? I live at that shelter. Van Buren? Yes, sir. Okay. Honestly. Well, Honestly. maybe. Uh, Back to this shit is wild. Know, it's kind the of The only a, a thing that I could give, buddy, is he just doesn't seem like he's much of a liar. <laughs> so I definitely think that his ass got robbed for sure. It's not funny. But this shit is, this whole situation is just so wild, bro. Like, even the cops said, like, man, this shit is nuts because Buddy's just super honest. He was, he was just trying to buy some ice, get old girl right, so he could fuck. Like, this, that's all this was? Like, she a prostitute. She out here living on the streets, doing drugs, fucking her way through, through life at this point. And you know what I'm saying? Buddy over here living on the streets, living out of a shelter. And like I said, he woke up and was like, I got $25. I just need some pussy today. Like, you know what I mean? Like, holy shit. This say, is wild, bro. Probably uh, Ixnay on the <laughs> Ugdrays there for a while. All right. Maybe find maybe find a way to attract women that don't, don't need, need to be I seduced by drugs, such bro. A taste. I know, man. What's your name, man? Uh, Pierre Williams, P-I-E. R-R-E. Uh, W-I-L-L-I-A-M-S. Birthday? 621-89. That's 25 bucks. Yes, sir. I got the description. <laughs> uh, 5'10", 150. Had a little, had a little, little, yeah, little beardish yeah, kind. Yeah. Champion backpack. Nah, blue champion hoodie. Black, blue champion. Black backpack, back, black pants. Okay. Black blue guy. champion hoodie. The black guy, you said? Yep, black guy. How about the skin tone? Dark, light? Dark, real, dark. real, real dark. Like, okay. black, black. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, let me... like anybody in that. Yeah. Right, right. I'm about to say, there ain't nobody in that house that was that color, bro. That house was full of white people. 
<laughs> oh man. And new, and buddy in his goddamn cowboy boots. Right there, my man. Yeah. Try to try to find uh, better places to hang out too, cause y'all need someone out here. <laughs> <laughs> forty nine doing forty nine stuff. Yes, I love these whores. Well, all right. I love these whores. <laughs> <laughs> Buddy is just like I told you. Leave, leave them alone too. They're gonna get you. I know. Yeah, they can uh, get you some kind of disease that you can't shake off. Right, but you're, yeah, tell them. <laughs> that was some good shit. I, I mean, I can't, bro. This was one of the funniest ones we've seen. Because, buddy, I, we ain't seen nobody this honest on any of these videos, bro. We ain't seen nobody this honest on any of these videos. Buddy shut the whole situation down and said, I got this. Shut your ass up. Let me talk. I was trying to buy some drugs with my last $25. I was trying to get this bitch right. I was trying to fuck. That's all I was trying to do. And buddy ran off with my money, my drugs, and now I ain't got no money and I ain't got no pussy. Like, God damn. All right, man. Y'all know what y'all thought about that down in the comments below. That shit look crazy. And I'm going to catch y'all the next one. Peace.